you're the number one consumer. If you take a look at the billboards right now, straight across the country, you can tell every company has a product for a young Kenyan. Mm -hmm. Because we're the ones who are many. You get what I mean? Mm -hmm. We're the number one focus. For the first time in a very long time, they need us. You get? But within that same breath, you know, it's uh, very, very easy to get misled. All right? Very, very easy to get misled in various sectors as a young person, you know? You go out seeking guidance or someone will approach you with an idea or something it's very very easy to get misled what i want to tell you one is i want you to maintain your independence young kenyans okay you need to maintain control of your life control of what you're doing control of your vision and the dream if you are 23 right now okay you're 23 right now and you have a huge dream and you've already started putting in the work you have already started putting in the work as to how you're going to pursue this your dream there is no way someone who is 44 or even 38 like fellow will be able to guide you on how you're going to make that dream come true this is someone from a different era with a different mode of operation with a different vision and more often than not you'll find that these older people are using you to fulfill another part of their dream so you might think the focus is you when it's actually them number two I want us to also understand that, you know, entry level is never at the top. It is never, ever, ever at the top. The thing about progression is that it is consistent. You start at level one, you go to level two, you go to level three, you go to level four. I encounter a lot of you young, amazing, creative people who want to get into entry level at the top. It doesn't work like that. Oh, shall I pick you Sani? Seme kwa mfano, umepigia msani, a young, new, upcoming artist. Be like, you know what? I like what you're doing. I want to give you this opportunity. And I want to pay you. How much is it going to cost? Msaya kuambia 650,000. Yeah? And just like that, you're like, okay, sawa, um, I don't have 650. I have 150 right now. Can you? No, 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 no. Misa is in a trend. Mini msaya wa 650. And I get it. You value yourself. It's very important to value yourself. But just like that, you miss out on the opportunity that could take your career to the next level. Unani get. So please be deliberate about every single move that you're making in your dream. Because it's your dream. Nobody can drive that dream other than you. Can I say something? You know, I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky that... Uh, I've got a chance to work with the young people. Okay, mm. uh, I sit in the biggest radio station, and I'm I'm in right in the space where they are. Mm. I'm in their Instagram. All right, mm -hmm. I'm one of the most followed people in those spaces of theirs. Mm -hmm. That I'm lucky that I was able to cut across into their generation. Yeah. All right, but any time you meet these people, wow. Anytime you see how people who didn't understand them want to use them mm -hmm. and want to kill their dreams. Kabisa. We don't understand a lot of things you people do. We are not aware. It's a different generation altogether. Kabisa. Go for that dream. Push it. You. Do not even explain it to us. It is you yourself who knows what you're talking about. Kabisa. Let's do this, guys. Completely. Mm. You've heard. It's your dream. You know what you want to do and you know where you're going to go. Who better to move yourself forward other than you? One and I'm saying we need care about you more than you care about yourself. I'm just saying, food for thought. Don't miss out on fundamental opportunities because one, you're being misled. Two, you're being misled. Three, you're being misled. Maintain your independence. Drive your dream. Drive your vision. Focus, focus, and move. Don't let anyone into that mess.